still funny. Loading screen, this is a loading screen, this is a loading screen, get up the game. <laughs> his, his freaking car turns into the Batmobile. <laughs> I just remembered that. That's amazing. using his revolutionary rhetoric. Holy shit. find him. Let's put our drones in the air and start a search. I'll run a trace on his cell. In the meantime, we have to probably ask 50 other cars. The computer's been analyzing. It's not like he needs his Batmobile to be a freaking Corvette or whatever that on the thing is. The residue I scan on Montoya is similar to the nerve agent I found at the docks. Let's see what we got. It's ironic that Found gonna work. died at the hands of someone drugged with his chemicals. Who'd have guessed that's how he'd meet his maker? Prone in his sick bed, surrounded by police who were ordered to protect him. Murder at the hands of Montoya. That's not justice. Whoever did this was justice is everything. And justice. Nothing more. No one should act as all three. I hope he told you something before he was killed. Justice. What did you learn from him? Practically family, he said. Family? Funny, I don't recall any Sunday dinners with the mob. It wasn't Falcone who called the hit. Yeah, well, I suppose that makes sense. Your father, Hill, and Falcone would have balanced each other out. He just said that. How do you know? Computers pinpointed reference points on the two compounds. Doc, so Montoya sent This refined drug is like Montoya. It only took a small injection to strip Montoya of her moral filters and make her act on her base impulses. Well, I guess that sort of thing happens. The men at the docks were doused yeah, with the morals get the out of the way. Messy. They were out of control. You're fucking postal. Both compounds seem stable, but they're quick to fall apart. Whoever processed it knew what they were doing. What could the creators of such a drug possibly have in mind? Fighting your wars is one thing, but drugging others to fight them for you? Oh. With this drug, they can exploit anyone's baser impulses, the things they would otherwise control. Your drones are in position to triangulate Cobblepot's location. Chaos breeds chaos. That's a shit map, I have to say. Doom has a better map. I should play Doom. I will at the princess. Press A when you find the portion of the single. Up, uh, find a portion of this. Uh, there it is. Find her! Find her now! Send a strong message! Okay. Send the message. Warm. There we go. Man, why wouldn't go cutting off people's heads? It's not funny. Plus, I thought you were a more interesting guy than just guy chopping people's fucking heads off. Well, chop your head off. All right, then. Jesus, didn't even wait for Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Going to speak with him, Bruce? Bruce Wayne already tried talking with Cobblepot. It's time he met the Batman. Batman! Time for justice to be handed out on a silver platter. Alright. Yay, Batman. What is that thing? 
Is that Solomon Grundy? Solomon Grundy, born on the Monday. That looks exactly like Solomon Grundy, only shorter. Because he's dead! Falcone's dead, now we can get to more interesting... ...characters. Who gives a fuck about Falcone? He ain't no godfather. Come check out his office. Batman's not about the mob, it's about... ...the Joker. And Two-Face. The Riddler. Awesome shit like that. Scarecrow. There you go. Let him go. Hi. Batman! It's about time. You kill a crime boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. Oh, don't worry, I'll pass your gratitude on to those who made it happen. They'll be pleased to know you think so highly of their work. You used an innocent cop to do your dirty work. I know how you've been using the drugs you stole at the docks. Where are they? Is this about Falcone? We all saw how you felt about Falcone. Pounded him into a pump on live TV. If you were truly the defender of this city, you'd have finished the job yourself. Admit it, Falcone deserved to die. Vermin like Falcone, they deserve to be stomped out. Believe me, I know. You don't decide who lives and who dies. That's not justice. But it's bloody well satisfying, isn't it? You're not a god. A show of good faith. You're a man, I'm not a god. This one go. How's about we talk this through? We All are right. With Falcone. Let's talk for now. We could just cut out the rest of the rot, like Wayne and Hill. Ordinary folks might be able to breathe. Oswald Cobblepot. What is it about this place that attracts criminal scum like you? Gotta admit, you've got flair. Here's the thing. I actually admire you, Batman. We both want the same kinds of things. Me and my people, we've got big plans for Gotham. You can want the same things all you want. They found Catwoman. You're a bit of a monster. We had a deal. She didn't make good on it. So, Fucking Catwoman. Sorry this didn't work out, mate. Dumb bitch. I'd stay and watch. I would, but I still got a Catwoman problem to deal with. Oh, what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful name. <laughs> oh, he knows who she really is. Good! So you can deal with you can deal with her then. Now I gotta deal with Solomon here. Excuse me, sir. I think it's time you stop that. Gonna have to try harder than this. Christian on a Tuesday. Married on a Wednesday. I don't remember the rest of them. It's been a while since I played Arkham City. Still haven't played Arkham Knight, though. Track down Selena Kyle. I'll find her right away. You see the see the problem with that was there was no sarcastic quip. And there should have been some sarcasm in Alfred there. But I've been spoiled by Michael Caine's Alfred. All the other Alfreds are smart asses like him. Stack deck, six PM, no capes. No capes? What is this? The Incredibles? No capes. Making 
Incredibles references, what the hell? <laughs> I don't know, fucking bars. What is it about bars? Yeah, who's who is not going to recognize He's Bruce Wayne? In the race for the mayor's office, as Harvey Dent backer Bruce Wayne comes under fire for alleged corruption. Joining me live is Mayor Hamilton Hill. Mr. Mayor, you said earlier today that in light of the allegations against him, Bruce Wayne should distance himself from Dent, but that was unlikely to happen. Why? He strikes me as well the jealous sort, very possessive of his toys. Better keep a low profile. Did you hear? Fucking politicians. Cops raided his house. <laughs> Sorry, his manor. Uh, didn't you see the game here, asshole? Are you blind or something? I see a monkey with a stick. <laughs> <laughs> no. My bad. I'm not looking for trouble. It looks like it found you. Wait a minute, I know you. You're that rich dude. You're that guy on the news. Want an autograph? I'll sign whatever you want. <laughs> what the, what the hell did you say? Bruce, stop stirring up the natives and buy me a drink. Wait, what? <laughs> this guy's with you? Face it, Frank, you suck at pool. Why are you starting trouble over it? <sighs> nice one, Bruce. Way to keep a low profile. The hair is shit. Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. That's why I'm here. You're in danger. I've had rats on my tail all day. The man who hired you, his name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. Calls himself Penguin, dead eh? Anyway. When you screw someone uh, over, you really screw them. The Penguin. Kind of thought of something else? Huh? <laughs> I'm going to deal with it. But I need you to tell me everything you know about him. I'd rather you not get involved. It's I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? You two have a lot in common. Questionable morals? I'm Batman! Why Gotham? Why not? Justice is not like a questionable moral. Abroad. Why leave that? He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. If Penguin is everything you say, there's no tree high enough for you to climb. He will find you. So what are you suggesting? The bat helps the cat? And the cat helps the bat. Bruce, sweetie, the gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey You're a selfish that. twat. Keep Harvey out of this. The less he knows, the safer he'll be. I'm sure his safety is your paramount concern. You and I... I'm sure you can shut your mouth. Well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says... Hello. We're gonna have us as a powwow. If you care about your own skin, 
Yo, get the hell out. All right, let me just get up. <laughs> oh, <holy shit. laughs> it looks like he's freaking shooting him. <laughs> Jesus Christ! This is gonna be some hardcore shit. Oh, I love it! <laughs> there will be blood. Come on, man. <laughs> uh, I did most of the work there. Pick up the slack. Nope. Gentlemen, suplex! Oh, you would have made my year. Man, I almost marked out there. Batman doing a German fucking suplex. But that was still a suplex. Not done yet. Oh, you want some of this? Get you some. X. Spelliarmus. That was another thing to say. This is this is actually awesome fight here. The music could be a little bit cooler. And louder. I think they want more. You know, Let's audible. It to him. That's a sexual innuendo. <laughs> that was sweet. Who's <laughs> some like freaking swords? Can't touch the bat. Almost just pretty probably, probably broke his freaking neck. I just tossed the cat. Should have been on the window. You're pretty good for such a pretty boy. You're very pretty good for such a pretty girl. You're both a couple of preppies. This way. Yeah, hey, Carlos, girl. Yo, man, I beat up your boyfriend. Want to hang? Quick, check the alleyway. You see anything? I'll show you what the bat's Take like, it. baby. Let's check the other side. You didn't even check it. Cops in this city suck. Are we alone? Balls. Are we alone? Yeah, we're, we're alone. <laughs> Fuck you. She's always horny. <laughs> oh, fuck it. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I'll take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. Are we in this together? Will you help me stop Penguin? I'm gonna say maybe, but only because he's trying to kill me. Pretty good reason to say yes. You shouldn't trust me, you know. No, I shouldn't. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smart. She reminds me of Littlefinger there. To see if there's anything on the phone we can use. The smartest thing you did after you got off your hearse was distrust me, or whatever the hell you said. I forget. It's fine. As the back as well, since I've seen Game of Thrones. Bruce, there are a number of messages here, all from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Somebody's a rat. This is very shady indeed. Whatever 
they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. Co is setting me up. Penguin's gonna take a shot at me. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but if I may offer a word of advice... Who's just going from one person to the next asking for answers? Batman, after how you handled Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. Goes Batman. Goes Bruce. <laughs> Interesting choice. I mean, if plot wise, it doesn't matter, but uh. Character-wise, I I I think I, I want to go with Bruce. That could be cool too. Time to rely on the silver tongue. Calling this Bruce is the smart choice. 